This player pick can contain team of the years. Let's rip them open and see what we get. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable ultimate team coins, check out mmoexp.com. Link in the description, say 5% using code HABER. It's an encore player pick grab bag. It contains a player pick one of three from any campaign up to and including ultimate birthday. So you got a 15% chance of an RTTK. Uh, 2.3 times of a women's road to the knockout, and you've got a 12% chance of Europa League, 19% Trailblazer, 17% Centurion, 14% Thunderstruck, 15% Radioactive. Whereas, I want to see Team of the Year being less than 1%. Team of the Year player less than 1%. You can get Team of the Years in there. Well, it's every promo up to foot birthday. So, let's see what we get in our Encore player pick. No team of the season. Sorry, no team of the year for me. I'm saying team of the season now because it's the warm-up. But uh, we got ourselves Saigankov, 87 rated. It's only 350 FC points. It's not like it's the most expensive one. So I'm not massively upset. Um, we also got a few other store packs, didn't we? So we also have a Fate and Fantasy Encore pack, which includes two guaranteed Future Stars, Fantasy FC, or Ultimate Birthday items, including heroes and icons. So let's see what we get in this. We have got ourselves a an Austrian attacking midfielder from Cologne. It's not great, is it? It's Keynes. Who is going to be our other player there? It's going to be Morgan. Oh, my word. That's actually really good, I think. I'm pretty sure it's actually really good. She was expensive when she came out, I remember. Wait, is it tradable? It's tradable. Oh, my God. That's actually really good. I need to sell this quick. What is her lowest buy now? I did not realize this is tradable. 357k. I'm going to take a... Uh, I'll take 300k for it if she sells quickly. I'll happily take 300k for that. Oh my word. That is class. That is absolutely fantastic. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even realize it was tradable. Oh, get in there. We love that. And the last store pack that they re released today is the uh, Halftime Encore pack. Um, this one contains Ultimate Dynasty, Team of the Group, Stage FC versus blah, blah, blah. This one's kind of boring, to be honest. I, I don't know why I'm opening this one. I'm just opening it for the sake of opening it. I probably shouldn't, really, because I'll be honest with you, like, I don't think it's very good at all. Uh, we've got ourselves... It's just Inform McAllister, because the best of Team of the Week's out as well right now. So we've got some decent Team of the Week's in packs as well. Um, I'm trying to think who the best Team of the Week is, actually. Maybe, I don't know, Van Dyke? I'm not really sure. Um, all right, let's see what we got in this pack then. Ooh, 91 Courtois is decent fodder. That's okay. I'll actually take that, to be fair. 91 Courtois isn't that bad. We'll take that. We also got a re-release of the 88 Plus Mixed Campaign pick, which we'll open up just to see what we get anyway. I doubt we'll get anything good, but we'll see what we got EA. We got one choice that's not a, a duplicate already. We'll take 90 rated Boniface. Bonnie face. And uh, call it a day there. All right, John's got his mixed campaign pick next. What are we saying? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Oh, my God. There's no way. There's no way. Sorry, I'm not controlling it, by the way, in my hand, because it's a share screen, not a share play. Uh, before anyone thinks I'm just like, I don't know, faking or something. I'm not. Oh, my God. Let's go, man. That is class. Finally, we might have a thumbnail. That's not a lie. All right, on to my second account now. We've got a Scampaign and an Icon pick. That's not bad. Ramos or Mukoko. I'm, I'm drilled in, like, this Ramos was expensive when it came out, and Mikoko's obviously was decent when it came out as well. So I'm drilled into thinking that's actually really good, but it's actually not that great. In April, we got Tots next week. These cards will quickly be overtaken by Team of the Season. Uh, we'll take 91 Sanchez. Not ideal, to be fair. Not the greatest Not the greatest little session there on the on the second account in terms of, uh, in terms of what we got. Rex thinks he's hilarious. Rex thinks he's really funny, doesn't he? Oh, look at me. I'm a Man City fan. Me, 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 All right. I hope you get a rubbish pick now, mate. I hope you get a rubbish pick. Yeah, have that, mate. Have that. That's what you get. That's karma. That is karma. I'm griddying on you right now, mate. All right. We've got Lala's Encore player pick. We're going to buy a bunch of these for the viewers today. So we can hopefully open a bunch of these and hopefully get some team of the years, to be honest. So let's see what our next Encore player pick has got to offer. 90 Pascarau. 
This being literally every promo in the game is going to be really interesting to see just random, like Mendy, for example, and Ivan Cavallero. Uh, we'll take the 90 Pasquale because it's, you know, 90 rated fodder, but not great. All right, next Encore player pick. What we say in EA? It's just fun seeing these old cards. I don't know why. None of these are usable, but it's just fun seeing them. Pedro Klosterman or Gallagher? Wow. That is um, that is exciting. Right, Ethan's got his campaign pick next. What are we saying? Will we get another Neymar? That, that fire Neymar is crazy, man. Is that the most expensive card in these? I feel like it might be. It's dropped a lot, to be fair. Ooh, ooh. Fede Valverde is definitely still usable. Lauren James is okay. This card doesn't really perform. I'll be honest with you, it does not perform. Uh, Valverde is solid. Muzial is decent. Ah, he takes Lauren James. Fair enough. All right, John has got his um, encore play pick. I think he's doing his the the fantasy birthday one as well. I forget what that one's called. Don't know why the little red outline at the bottom there freaks me out. I don't know why that was silly. Uh, Martinez quarter. 84 rated. I mean, that would compete. I reckon I reckon that against that Centurion Eusebio, mate, that I seem to face every foot champions game I ever play. Maybe, you know, maybe he competes there. Do you know what I mean? Ah, <laughs> oh, all right. There's a, I think it's a Fate and Fantasy. Or is it? Yeah, Fate and Fantasy Encore pack. Uh, includes the two guaranteed fantasy slash future stars slash ultimate birthday. This is tradable. Obviously, I got Morgan. So you want a good card in this tradable. Hello, that's an icon. There is an icon. Can confirm there is an icon. The first player is not great. The first player is Pascarau, but there isn't a foot birthday icon or a future stars icon or something. And it's tradable. It's uh, future stars, Mirror's Love Closer. Ultimate birthday. I, don't, I forget. They look exactly the same. It's uh, Mirror's Love Closer. Not great. It is tradable, though. You might get like 90k out of that, maybe. Potentially. Ooh, and inform uh, Regulon, who's like the biggest Man United fan ever, apparently. Not ideal. He's like 30k. Fair enough. All right. We have got Dan's Encore player pick next. What are we saying? That's actually probably our best one so far. You got Birthday Pulisic or um, Thunderstruck Bernardo Silva. I mean, I would personally pick Daniel Amati here. This card competes, man. Daniel Amati versus like... Galazzo Bobby Charlton. Easy. Easy. Easy Daniel Amati body right there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, aside from that, yeah, no. That's, uh, I mean, but that still was 91 rated. All right. Our next encore player pick grab bag. Will we get our first team of the year? Can you imagine? Just imagine getting a team of the year in this. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you got the double MLS. You got the, you got the, you got double MLS and an American in there. You know, that that's the dream right there. Yeah, I, uh, no, this, I can't. I, I, no. All right, come on. We got Thomas's pick next. Let's get a team of the year. Or just like, I don't know, like, a, I don't know, something good. I can't think. Just something, something decent, please, EA. Ooh. That's not, like, that, uh, it's not as high rated. Teddy Tumor, by the way, what a baller. He was incredible last year. I think it was it. Was it USG you was at? I just remember him putting up absolute numbers. Um, but I mean, like, you know, it's all off ain't a bad card. It's not great, but like, you know, I don't know. We're on my second account now. We're going to open up the Fate and Fantasy Encore pack and then the Encore player pick. So, Fate and Fantasy Encore pack first. We do not have an icon. We've got ourselves a German centre mid from Hoffenheim. Cheeky stack. Who is going to be the flip side? Go on, be another, like, decent card, man. I sold that Morgan for 300k. Who is this? Who is that? Roared. I don't think she's worth a huge amount, is she? No, maybe, like, 20-odd K, if that. The reason why I sold that Morgan straight away is because I knew she'd drop really quickly uh, with these packs being out. I think naturally the cards are just going to drop because they're going to get packed tradable and sold straight away. So that's why I sold it for like 300k. And so give someone a deal as well. All right, here we go with my own core player pick. Let's get team of the year now, yeah? Why not? 90 Pascarau again. Or 89 Dan Juma. He was so common during Ultimate Birthday as well. We'll take 90 Pascarau. It's not amazing, but it'll do. It will do. I've not even opened my 10, 10 coin Energizer pack either. Should we open that real quick? 10 coin pack. Best of team of the week's impacts. Or zero. Oh, you can open it for zero FC points? I didn't even try that. 
Okay, that wasn't great. Fair enough. Can you buy this with zero FC points then? No. Okay, you can't. Fair enough. Has to be 10 coins at least. Well, I thought they might mess that up and just got it for free. Uh, 10 coin pack on my main account now. What we got? We got a Colombian. Colombian striker. No way. <gasps> Luis Muriel. I swear I got him on my second account. What the heck? Hey, get out of my packs, man. What are you doing, fam? All right. Baps scam pain pack. Pick. Sorry. Pick. What are we saying? What are we saying, EA? Oh, mad. That's actually really good. That's the first Doku we've seen. We got Gohan Hacho last week, but we've not seen a Doku yet. I imagine he's come down in price like mad. I remember packing this card when it was 3 mil. He's still half a million coins, though. He's still half a million. Rex is fuming. Rex, if you didn't discard the main item badge, you'd have got him, mate. Half a mil. We take that. That's like 10 mil in inflation terms. Let's go. All right. Ethan's encore player pick. Grab bag. What are we saying? Who is the best? Is it 91 Banana Silver is the highest rated? Who's the most expensive card we've had so far? Is it? I don't even know who it is. It's not, we've not had anyone like crazy to shout home about. Let's see if we get a team of the year in one of these. I really hope we do. That would be awesome, man. Oh. Yeah. Pedro Porro is not bad. Pedro Porro is okay. That's not bad. Um, so Johnny Renders. He had a good game against Roma, even though that Milan lost. But apart from that. Uh... All right. We have got Buddy's encore player pick next. What are we saying, EA? Yeah. Come on. Another 91 Banana Silver. I don't want to see Lavelle in there. Lavelle really annoys me. If I'm being honest with you guys, Lavelle, Lavelle really annoys me after Ultimate Birthday and how often we saw her in packs. All right, we have got Anthony's Encore player pick next. What we say in EA? Another 91 Banana Silver. He's very common. We've got Klaus, who's not a terrible pull. Um, he was definitely decent when he came out anyway. But, yeah, aside from that, unfortunately, not ideal. All right, we've got Dan's Scampaign pick now. Ooh, that Gundawan is a huge pull, actually. That's sick. That is very good. I mean, Bernardo Silva was in there, hilariously. Gundawan is a really good pull, though. Is he still expensive? About 130k. That card, by the way, is absolutely monstrous in-game. It is so good. It really is so good. John's, I think, RTG account with the Encore pick. What are we saying? That Mikenga card doesn't even look that bad. Di Maria. Eh, you know. All right, Rex just wants that 91 Bernardo Silva. That's what he wants. 91 Bernardo Silva. Of course, he doesn't get Bernardo Silva. He gets Olga Carmona. We get a team of the year... Honorable mention. So it's the first team of the year HM. Then Nanny as well. The GOAT. But unfortunately, um, yeah, no Bernardo Silva for him. All right, John's got some peepees before 6 p.m. Fingers crossed there's a Galaza card in there. Ooh, that's all 83s. Yikes. Hey, Rositsky. As a Arsenal fan, he'd be happy with that. Arsenal PMP right there, mate. Oh, my word. What? Holy moly. Go on, John. He's like, I'm just opening these because we're probably getting nothing at 6 p.m. anyway. Worth it. He's absolutely smashed it out of the park. Oh, my God. That's actually sick. Go on, John. We've got one last chance of getting a decent... Um, a decent Galazzo card or like a 94 Village or something. This is our last chance. This is the last pack we're opening for Galazzo 2024. We've got Informer Penda and it, another Inform behind him. Inform Malcolm. Nice. Okay. All right. Fair enough. Any more Informs? Yes. We get Inform and Inform Majeki. Mo Salah, Renard. Okay. And Gary Lineker. Sadly, he's worth about. Three bob and a block of cheese. But you'll take it. Not bad. ET8 plus Econ player pick. All right, EA. I'm not asking for a lot here. Just like Team of the Year on 9 and that. You know what I mean? Good fodder. Good fodder. These are one of four now. The cheeky little scam pain picks. They're one of four, so you never know. We'll see. Let's see what we get. Oh, wow. Oh, on the main account, by the way. On the main account, by the way. Oh, wow. Oh, we'll happily take... Wait, Warren Zyre Emery is fantastic. 
on the main account. Thank you very much, EA. Let's see if John gets something good from his one of four. Ooh. Rico at least is okay. Maybe these are a bit better with one of fours then. All right, what has JH got? Oh, he'll be happy about that. Konate's class for him, to be fair. He'll be very happy with that. Ramos is not a bad card, though. But uh, as a Liverpool fan, he's buzzing with that. All right, what's his campaign pick going to say? Come on, EA. Sort us out. Oh, no way. Nah, don't you dare, man. Oh, it's Rex. Of course, he's picking Muziala. Man, that Hoyland card is creme de la creme. All right, Lala campaign pick. What are we saying? Eh? Oh, oh, mad. That Son is actually really good. It's a shame because I'm pretty sure Son got an even better card, didn't he? Like, after. Yeah, he got a foot birthday card. But that Son card is actually so good in this game. It's same as his foot birthday is a million coins. But that was still 400k. That Son card is legit in this game, by the way. That's really rare. It is a really rare card. You want Diani? Fair enough, but like, mad. I'm... I'd take Son there. Oh, I really hope Grass gets something bad now. Hey, Nico Williams ain't bad, to be fair. That's actually all right. Nico Williams is pretty legit. All right, here we go. Come on. This is it. Scampaign pick numero 744 of EFC 24. And we've got ourselves a Fantasy Deluxe in the third slot. Oh, imagine. Tamori. We'll take Tamori. Oh, wow. That's actually quite... Mm, nah, it's not. Tamori's a brick wall in this game, by the way. But... Yeah, Calvin Ogley makes sense. All right, campaign pick for Mike. What are we saying? Another Fakaya Tamori. Not the right one this time. Uh, the CDM one, significantly worse. But you take it anyway. All right. Next player pick. campaign for Ethan. These seem like... They seem more fun. I'm going to say, we didn't see Medima at all. Rarely see Rudiger. Rarely see Fire Komen. They seem a little bit more fun this week. All right. What's this one saying on my second account? Ooh, not great. I'll take Luke Gieber. That one's not amazing on the second account today. All right. Toby has got a campaign pick. What's Toby saying? Yes, I'm in the dark today as well. I do apologize. I'm just can't be bothered to turn the lights on. I feel like my, my colorful shirt is uh, doing enough, enough justice for us. You know what I mean? We don't need the bright anything else. Oh. Orban. I haven't seen him yet. That's interesting. Aside from that, I mean, you know. Scampaign. I'm getting blinded by this one, by the way. It's so bright. Ah. Ah. It's a shame. All right. Scampaign pick. Here we go. That's, that, that's not bad, actually. Stanway. Stanway's really good. We'll take that.